the competition between Tesla and Xpeng has moved beyond electric vehicles, entering a new arena where innovation takes the form of humanoid robotics. As 2026 approaches, both companies are placing their next-generation humanoid robots at the forefront, betting that demand for these machines may one day eclipse their own vehicles. The question now isn't only about automation, it's about empathy. Can manufacturers who mastered factories replicate human-like interaction? And is there space for more than one leader in this rapidly evolving robot-driven world? In China, Xpeng claims it will begin mass production of its humanoid robots in 2026, showcasing machines that could have stepped straight out of science fiction. At the company's Guangzhou facility, excitement peaked when Xpeng unveiled a feminine variant of its iron robot. The robot's lifelike movements and uncanny realism went viral online, prompting a flood of speculation, could this be a human in disguise? To quell the rumors, Xpeng released footage of chairman and CEO He Xiaoping reacting to skeptics, confirming that the robot was fully mechanical. To further prove authenticity, Xpeng engineers demonstrated iron's construction, cutting through synthetic skin to reveal a fully articulated mechanical frame. On stage, the robot walked confidently with its metallic lower leg exposed, a clear statement that iron is designed not merely as a machine, but as a purposeful companion. Xpeng formally entered the robotics arena in 2020 by acquiring a Shenzhen startup founded by Xiao Tongyang, who later departed in 2023 to launch Engine AI, a new humanoid company. Since then, Xpeng has evolved its humanoid line, introducing a more sophisticated iron model a year after its first version, emphasizing a blend of human aesthetics and industrial robustness. Standing 178 centimeters tall and weighing 70 kilograms, the updated iron features a spinal column engineered to replicate human biomechanics. Its lightweight composite exoskeleton mirrors the appearance of muscle tissue rather than mechanical joints, while tactile-sensitive skin allows natural interactions with people and the environment. Internally, three Xpeng Turing AI chips provide more than 2,200 tera operations per second, roughly the same computing power found in autonomous vehicles. The robot can execute complex tasks using its vision language action model and is slated to run on solid-state batteries, promising improved durability, safety, and energy density compared to conventional lithium cells. Commercial rollout plans are ambitious. Xpeng aims to begin mass production by the end of 2026, starting with a scaled-down model under 170 cm. Masculine and feminine variants, along with multiple color options, will be available. While initial deployment will focus on customer-facing roles such as sales and service, Xpeng's pricing strategy is expected to remain lower than Tesla's, following the company's historical model pricing, which is typically 15-30% to less than Tesla vehicles in China. Iron's dexterity is another highlight. With 22 degrees of freedom in each hand, it rivals Tesla's Gen 3 bot in manipulatory capability. Tesla, meanwhile, is advancing its own humanoid initiative. At its Fremont, California factory, the company is building the first large-scale production line for Optimus, aiming for an annual output of 1 million units. Expansion to Texas could eventually scale production to 10 million units per year. Elon Musk has indicated that once the line reaches a million units annually, production costs could fall to approximately $20,000 per unit. Musk envisions Optimus not just as a labor-saving device, but as a transformative presence in society. From manufacturing and logistics to personal assistance and medical care, Optimus is intended to operate across a broad spectrum of human activity. Musk has described the robot as potentially surpassing the best human surgeons in precision and has even suggested applications in reimagining the prison system, proposing that humanoids could monitor and enforce rehabilitation in a more humane way. Beyond the practical, Musk frames humanoid robots as civilization-scale multipliers, machines capable of delivering near-limitless productivity and enabling universal high income by reducing reliance on human labor. However, he acknowledges potential risks, including dystopian outcomes reminiscent of science fiction, and has speculated about future integrations with Neuralink to enable digital consciousness transfer, offering a form of digital immortality. Tesla originally planned to manufacture 10,000 humanoids in 2025, 
but design refinements and supply chain constraints have delayed that goal to 2026. The latest iteration, Optimus 2.5, demonstrated advanced movement and even learned dancing through video data, showing four years of accumulated AI learning since the first concept was teased with a cosplayer. Musk projects that the Generation 3 Tesla bot, slated for early 2026, will astonish the public with its realism. Catwoman-style variants are reportedly in development. While humanoid robots dominate headlines, quadrupedal robots are quietly gaining momentum. Chinese robotics companies are rapidly producing four-legged models capable of performing high-risk tasks in environments unsafe for humans. These machines are entering real-world applications faster than expected, offering practical benefits in both industrial and educational contexts. The humanoid and quadrupedal arms of Tesla and Xpeng represent two complementary approaches. One emphasizes human-like interaction, the other efficiency and resilience in unpredictable terrains. Together, they illustrate a rapidly approaching reality where robots become integrated partners in daily life, capable of performing tasks once limited to humans, and redefining mobility, labor, and service. As Xpeng and Tesla push the boundaries of robotics, the world watches a transformative era unfold. Machines that were once science fiction are stepping into reality, blurring the lines between human and artificial intelligence, and opening a new chapter in the way we live, work, and interact. The 2026 race is not just about vehicles, it's about who will define the future of humanoid companions.